Somebody got to come on. Nick Salter Formaggio coached East Jefferson to a state title and behind the heroics of Puka Williams led Hallville to the Dome. But Coach Salt's last job didn't go as smoothly. He was let go by Holy Cross after three years on the job. Salt was a 1977 graduate of the Catholic school. The whole situation at Holy Cross, when that all happened, that lit a fire under me. I learned a long time ago in this profession, you never take two bad jobs, never. And I took one and, and uh, it, it cost me dearly, it cost me personally, uh, it cost me professionally. And when Shane Smith called, he didn't have to ask twice. I know what Franklinton is. I played against him and coached, uh, coached against him. And uh, I, knew it. I knew what that school is. And you pull up to it, you see, you know, state championship banners and you see state runner-up banners and you see a big field house and you see a community that cares. He's pulling. He's pulling. Franklinton owns one state title. They got one back in 2010. That community is hungry for some more hardware. I told the kids this. There's something special about coaching at a school whose name is worn by the town. It just makes it a different atmosphere. You know, I had an opportunity to do it, obviously, at Hornville. And, and, and in some respects, East Jefferson's on it. Jeff, you know, East Bank of Jefferson Parish and then uh, Chalmette High School at Oconee County. All those schools whose names wear the, uh, the symbol of the city, uh, it's special. It's been a joy for me. It's, it's, it's really been everything that I could have hoped for, uh, you know, at the at the uh, last 10, 12 years of my career. Coach Salt and the Demons opened their 2023 regular season against Bogalusa. From Uptown, Garland Gillen, Fox 8, Local First.